So before the video starts, I want to tell you that it's my first video on YouTube, and I have to apologize for my sniffing a lot if I do. Uh, I've got some sort of um, blocked nose cold thing, so um, my future videos should be fine. So, we'll start with adventure mode, get a new campaign on the go. Stay a while and listen, and I will tell you a story. A story of dungeons and dragons, of orcs and goblins, of ghouls and ghosts, of kings and quests, but most importantly, of wizards and vampires. Well, a story of wizards. Once upon a time, in a land known as Midgard, there lived a powerful wizard named Grimnir, who sought to harness the power of all magics, ancient spells crafted in times long forgotten. With such knowledge, he might enable the wizards of the Order of Magic to spread eternal peace across the lands. But the Order of Magic instead felt threatened by his ambitions, and in the shadows they schemed and devised a treacherous plan. And so, Grimnir's disciples were expelled from the Order, and he himself was, for all time, imprisoned at World's End. All because of his dangerous lust for knowledge. Grimnir's dangerous ambitions dashed, the world was safe once more. Aside from the increased number of monsters attacking the good villagers. And of course the warlord Khan who had united the orc tribes and now threatened the great city of Havendir. But in the dusty gloom of Castle Aldraheim, where the Order of Magic dwelled, a brilliant teacher and his finest pupils were about to embark on a journey that would prevent the world from changing forever. Melde, ye va Vlad, o ye va Nol Vampir, ni va Valda Spatzen Havendir, o Yalp Odir. Right. Anastigode, Grimnir Bortz, Monster. Grimnir's gone. Monsters are roaming the land. King needs your help, and Vlad is not a vampire. Must go to Hamida. All right, so off we go. Uh, you move with your mouse, and you run with click. My character is awesome, part of a DLC, and I can teleport about. Oh, maybe not. Not yet. Hilde. Look, they're having a party downstairs. You hurry and go get some cheese. Apparently wizards love cheese. Let's go. Sweet, downstairs. Surprender! Um, we started Dunka Dunka right on. And yeah, I read it behind Ooster. Alex gone to the East Tower to get some more. Cheers. Cheers. No, you're not grim now. No, I didn't. Oh, what? Don't do anything stupid. Oh. Well done. Yep, just fine. Okay, you do that. What? Secret word is banana? Okay. Uh, Magic is a game where you can experiment up to... F and combine up to five elements to create spells. Experimentation is important and there are thousands of combinations at your disposal. Before you need to... Before you can conjure any elements, you need to get a staff. Go get one from the weapons rack. So we run over, get one. Life. 
Life is a beam. It heals, cures poison, and damages undead. So opposite is arcane. Okay. It seems you've taken some damage from your fall. Now that you have a staff, you can heal yourself. Conjure a life element by pressing W. Now that you've got a life element on your spell bar, you can cast it on yourself by mouse buttoning. Boom. And apparently I don't have a staff. I've got these um, smoke bombs instead, so I can teleport. Boom. Awesome, I'm healed up. Now cut the rope with your sword. I don't have a sword, I've got a crossbow. Boom. Hold shift and click. Earth. Earth is a projectile. It is, deals physical damage. Its opposite is lightning. Conjure three elements, then hold the button, the right, mu the right mouse button to charge your force and release it against the wooden boards. It looks pretty weak. Screw three, I'm going five. Bigger the better, right? Right. Fire. Fire is a spray. Fire damage over time causes panic and dries wet targets. Opposite is cold, of course, because, you know, warmth and cold don't go together. So we get fire and now we have to light the torch. We'll extend the bridge. Uh, cast it and then cast it. Sweet. Right. On the other side of the chasm is a torch, but it's too far for the spray to reach. Yes. This can be cast... Oh. Combine earth and fire to create a fireball. Okay. Earth, fire... Even though I did it backwards, it doesn't matter. Try to hit the torch with a fireball. Whoops. Oh, I hit it. Right. Uh, so we... Go here. Lightning! Type lightning. <laughs> Properties lightning damage. No way. Jumps from target to target. Opposites are earth and water. Lightning. Okay, so over here, there's some more lightning turrets things. That water made your robes all wet. As everyone knows, dabbling with electricity while you're wet is a very bad idea. Really? Oh, yes. You must dry yourself by conjuring fire and casting it on yourself. Ow. Do not try this trick while you are not wet because it will hurt. As it does. Oh no. Oh no. I've just teleported through the gate. <laughs> I did not know you could do that. Uh, okay, so now that you are dry. You have to electrify both generators at the same time. The easiest way to do this is by casting an area spell. Let's get back over there. Uh, do this by shift pressing and holding right mouse button. Uh, okay, so apparently I need to get an element first, then do it. Right. Arcane. Arcane is a beam. Arcane damage. It's explosive and it heals undead. Its opposite is life. Right. So that's too far away. I need to combine it with a beam to extend the reach. So a beam being life or arcane. Let's do arcane. Boom. There we go. Cold. Cold is a spray. Slows your enemies and it freezes bodies of water. Opposite is fire. Right. So the cellar is flooded and as everyone knows, uh, wizards can't swim. Cold is not only good for slowing down your enemies, it can also be used to freeze bodies of liquid. So let's freeze it. You can do it like that, and it'll freeze, and then 
slowly come back, or you can do it all at once. Boom! With the shift click uh, AOE attack. Okay, water. What is a spray? It soaks and it douses flames. Its opposite is lightning. Okay, so uh, the furnaces that keep the castle warm are on and the path appears to be blocked. It seems the only way around is to go through the furnace and as wizards are highly flammable <laughs> it would be wise to use water to put the fire out. Right, water. Brilliant. I'll beam it up and put them both out at the same time. And just run through. A long time ago, no wizard thought it would be a good idea to have this masher installed. It hasn't proven to be that useful though. But look, there's an old tome of magic in the bookshelf. It may help you get past the masher. You've learned haste. You should use haste to pass the masher. Navigate your way through the list of magics with a scroll wheel. Like so. And I'll pull them up. Uh, when haste is selected, you uh, cast the elements that you need and press the space bar. So that's lightning, arcane, and fire. Wait for the masher to pass and cast it. Boom. Wow, that's a speed boost. Yeah. It uh, didn't seem to be very useful because the imps are still mashing away. Let's uh, kill the imps because it says the door at the end of the tunnel has been closed and will only empty uh, open when the imps have been taken care of. So let's give them a taste of a fire beam. Yeah, come on. Oh, there's more down there. Okay, uh, so... More fire and electricity. Boom. Boom. I think that's all of them. Yep, doors open. Right. The next door can only, only be opened by interacting with this lever. Alright. Boom. Behold. The Watcher. Okay. Shield. Type Shield. Properties Protective Barrier. Opposites Shield. Right. So Shield cancels out Shield. Uh, shields can be used as shields. <laughs> um, they can be used um, by just casting it regularly like that. Casting on yourself and casting AoE. I find the AoE is the best one. Right, so let's try taking this guy out. Okay, so that's not doing much, and that hurts. Um, there's a rope here, what does that do? Oh, that would have been a lot easier. Squished him. Okay, so here we go. Just kill Behold wow. the Watcher. <laughs> oh, uh, Behold that pet. Uh, yeah, yeah, we missed him. <laughs> it's probably best if we had his magic. Right, revive and crash the desktop. Okay. Maybe it's best you leave before we have any more accidents. Yep. Okay, let's go. I want to try out that one, though. Um, lightning, lightning, fire. Um, life. <laughs> Where'd he go? Who is that? <laughs> right, okay, so, um... Sorry, it was an accident. <laughs> right, so that's it. Hopefully it was good quality, and see you next time.